As the stars get closer to the horizon, they seem to slow down a little bit because of the atmospheric refraction. This is actually occurring in this video by uh, Babak Tafrashi, but it's a little hard to see. Uh, what I did is I waited until some very distinctive stars appeared, these two stars right here. And I took this section of the image and I and I took it into Photoshop, increased the contrast, and then placed a line every one second where the leading star was. So here's a full clip. I've added a time code so you can see that the uh, star does in fact coincide with the line at the exact one second mark. And here it is again at uh, one quarter speed. Now if you look carefully at the leading star of the two stars, when it hits a red dot or a green line, uh, it's going to be exactly the same as the, uh, the second mark on the time code. So here it is coming up on the five second, so five, six. So it's showing that these lines are spaced exactly one second apart, and as you can see, they get significantly closer together as you get closer to the horizon. So what would this look like if it was uh, actually going at a constant speed? Well, let's add some blue dots showing what would happen. Pairing the actual positions in the red dots with the extrapolated positions in the blue dots, you can see how far behind the star is lagging behind its actual geometric position, the blue dot. Here's a close-up of the final situation showing just how far this star's visual position is behind the actual position.